The city of Albuquerque is trying to tackle an old problem at dozens of city parks, a problem that leads to a lot of wasted water. But it could take time and a lot of money to fix. News 13's Annalisa Pardo is live in the International District this evening at Phil Chacon Park with more. Annalisa? Dean, take a look at this big puddle here at Phil Chacon Park. Since it hasn't rained, the Parks Department says it's a likely cause from the problems with the irrigation system here. It's an example of wasted water and something the city wants to avoid. Now, 31 of the city's about 300 parks have irrigation systems that are more than 50 years old. Total, there's about 120 acres of parkland that need irrigation upgrades. That doesn't mean that they run horrible. But we just recognize that we have some aged systems. While Chavez couldn't give us an exact amount on how much water gets wasted because of outdated systems, the Parks Department says on average, one irrigation renovation project helps them reach about 20% in water savings. So some of the parks that we've improved, we've, we've seen results of hundreds of thousands, if not you know, a million gallons of savings off of a renovation. And that's really the goal. Renovating all 120 acres needed will cost around $11 million. The, par the Parks Department is currently applying for a nearly $2 million state grant to help fix irrigation systems at Netherwood and Filchicon Parks and replace the pond, line, the pond liner at Ladera Golf Course. While Chavez says these parks don't have the oldest systems, they are outdated and need to be improved. Now here at this park, Chavez says the problem is actually prairie dogs are chewing through parts of the irrigation system. He he says updated equipment can prevent that and puddles and wasted water like this. Back to you. All right, Annalisa, thank you. Chavez says on average the Parks Department replaces irrigation systems at about five parks each year.